Hey everyone, uh, Morgan and oh, Eric, Eric how you doing? <laughs> here. Uh, we uh, stopped by Vegas and just had to say hi and do a quick little video. So we're out in the desert, this is my domain, yeah. Red Rock Canyon, there checking out the sights with a few hours of sunlight left. It is beautiful. We get like 10 hours, 12 hours of summer more. It's awesome. <laughs> yeah, it's great. It's, it's beautiful out here. And she's going to teach me how to do a video every day. <laughs> I'll do my best with <laughs> this your time is, management. This is today's. Whatever day you're watching this, it's, it's today. today's. It's the start of your daily video. <laughs> I challenge you. <laughs> oh, jeez. No, it's not going to happen. Darn. I'm, I'd be happy with a weekly at this point. I've been bad. If you want him to do a daily video, just put it down in the comments down below. Yeah. Okay, we're going to talk about three overhyped uh, prepper products and then three products that we wish we had. Ooh, okay. You go first. First overhyped product. Overhyped. I mean, I've seen these shirts. They say like con conquer something. Conquer today. I don't know. <laughs> That's rude. <laughs> no, there was. I was just thinking about this. What was it? A uh, crank. Crank flashlights. Oh my God. Thank yeah. You. I think they're a gimmick. Thank I don't you. think they uh, they don't work really well. The batteries in them aren't usually good. The crank, the, the cogs are plastic. I think I mentioned this in my video before. They break all the time. And the amount of work you have to put into them, it just doesn't make sense. It's an insane amount of work. I tried to uh, charge uh, the light from a crank flashlight, and I was cranking and cranking and cranking. And then it only gave me about a minute worth yeah, of light. Yeah, it's terrible. No, I agree. Can okay. I just make that my first one? I never sure. want <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, okay. I got I have tough time to think of another one. Okay. <laughs> All right. So, how about a product that you wish you had? A product that I wish I had a better vehicle. We were just talking about this. <laughs> Something four wheel drive. Yours is real gray man. It's super gray is. man. Perfect gray man vehicle. Yeah. That's obviously what I was going for. Uh, I just have a normal four door car. Nothing Never crazy. Know. I can blend in with the best That's of them. That's right. But there's a lot of off-road trail stuff, even where I go shooting, which I've talked to in my years about before. It's even just clearance. Not even necessarily always four-wheel drive, but just something with more clearance. And, you could and, lift it. Yeah, right? The Jetta. The, <laughs> the Jetta, Jetta with the six-inch lift. <laughs> that would be so Oh, sweet. that'd be uh, that'd be fantastic. <laughs> I get a whole used Jeep for what it costs to do that anyway. <laughs> so that's one thing I do wish I had was a more capable vehicle. Cool. Even just like a van or something more space and more clearance. Mm, for Four-wheel sure. drive would be my next vehicle for sure. Yeah. What about you? Next vehicle or next item you want to get? Okay, so an item that I would really oh. like is a freeze dryer. Ooh, yeah. I really I want to freeze They're like five grand, too. Dude, there's But you could really quickly make that up if you're actually freeze drying like pounds and pounds of no stuff. No kidding. Yeah, and I was thinking like maybe like a community freeze drying thing. I thought about the same thing. Like if I could get like five or six people and just share it, but that's hard, right. man. Yeah, to get people yeah. to, And share some people would just abuse thing. the heck out of it, I think. Oh, and sure. then you would end up footing the bill. <laughs> for sure. But it's a good idea, and it's definitely doable. Yeah. Maybe even get like a church or somebody on board. Somebody right? who wants, yeah. Hey. That would be doable. Yeah, get this going. Yeah. <laughs> you can ship it back and forth to each other, like hey. giant harvest right, oh. freeze dryer. Wow. <laughs> All right, so overhyped one. You got to go next now. I'll okay. The first one. Okay. Darn it. Okay. An overhyped one, I think, is the um, okay. candles that you can buy, like the. Uh, oh, the emergency 70 the hour emergency candles. 70 hour emergency. I think those are pretty overhyped because. Every time I see them, I, I'm like, okay, it's a candle. Yeah. <laughs> I can get this from a dollar store <laughs> and or also make my this, own. Yeah, exactly. And there's not a whole lot of situations where they're better than like a gas or oil lantern or something yeah, like that. Yeah, yeah. They do store well. I will give them that. Yeah. And they're cheap, but. And making your great. own really isn't that bad, though. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Let's see, another overhyped. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I don't think anyone overhypes kids. No. So now i got to think of another one. Yeah, I think Mountain one. House is a little bit overhyped. For the cost, per shut dollar. Your yeah. You shut your mouth. That doesn't mean it's not good, but I think the hype level oh. to like what you're getting though. Have I just pissed off everyone? Oh yeah, you lost all, all the your affiliates. <laughs> all the affiliates are pissed They're off gone. at me. The uh, no, I like I'm I like it, but it's the price oh. of like a whole M more than a whole MRE a lot of times. It's just yeah. the meal. Depending, yeah, depending. Oh. You're right. You know what I mean? So yeah. I think for what you're, they're good, and I, I have some. I'm not, so I'm not crazy. You know, <laughs> not some hater, but I'm just saying like, I think they're for prepping. I don't think they're ideal for like camping and trips. They're great. Okay. But if you're just gonna store a lot of food, it doesn't make sense to buy a ton of mountain house unless you have a ton of money. I like the number ten cans. I like. That's the bad. Yeah, that's true. That keeps it down a little bit. Yeah. But you can just buy giant cans of everything too. <laughs> 
I can eat simple it's rice. <laughs> I bet you just store rice and beans, don't you? Pretty much. Okay, well, that's my next overhyped item. It's rice and beans. Rice and beans. <sighs> Everyone. You know how many apocalypses have been survived by rice and beans? Please tell me. Multiple. Oh, Multiple. At least several. At least several. <laughs> several apocalypse. Um, I think rice and beans are very overhyped. Beans specifically. Rice? Okay, I will say rice is not overhyped. Beans, dry beans. Way Just because of t taste or what? No, because it takes so many resources to cook and so much time. It Dry does. Beans. If, but you can theoretically, you could just soak them in water and then eat them. You're right. You're but absolutely that would be gross. Right. I'm not <laughs> planning on doing that. The sun. That's why I like sun oven out here. Sun all day long. It's super hot. You just put them in there. You leave it. So it does take time still, mm -hmm. but it doesn't take uh, nearly as many resources. I like the sun So oven. that's good. Mm -hmm. That, that makes a huge that. difference, honestly. If you had to like boil the water with some with either fuel or wood, it would take a ton. Yes. If you're talking about having a fire going for I don't know, hour and a half every day, yeah. or whatever it would take yeah. to cook or, beans, or even the fuel or whatever, yeah, it I mean, does, take does take a long time. The sun oven specifically makes it a lot easier yeah. for rice and beans. Okay. So for me, I'll that makes a big to difference. That. I'll concede to that. Okay, where no, are we? No, I gotta go. <laughs> or oh, I have to, do I, am I saying another one I want to get or another one that's okay, overhyped? Okay, uh, do what oh, you want. Ooh, oh, Lord, oh, put me on the spot. <laughs> there was one, what was I just saying? Oh, well, I'll say another one that I do want to get at some point is some version of a battery bank and solar panel. It oh, doesn't have yeah. to be a pre-made one like the Kodiak, whatever that everyone has, although those seem nice. You can buy a deep cycle battery, you can buy a solar panel and an inverter, put them all together for probably half the price if you wanted to piece it individually yes so that's what i'd like to have at some point just a little setup because you can run a lot off that yeah agreed tons that's of stuff so that's my next one that's a good one um so next over height oh no you already did over you can be next one that you want to get okay next one i want to get um okay so the next product i want technically a product land land that's a good <laughs> land. one definitely not overhyped <laughs> not overhyped not overhyped yeah. <laughs> That, I would love that. Having space out here, though, you have to have, you can see super far because there's no trees. Oh, yeah, that's true. So even if you have like 10 acres, you're like, Ugh. <laughs> but that's way outside the city anyway, and there's no water, so it's pretty good. Yeah. So I would go. definitely would back you with that one. Nice. One thing I think are overhyped, they're still useful, so no one hating, hating on me, but plate carriers. I think you should go ahead and get the full vest. <clears throat> I'm wearing my Safe Life vest, or yeah, Safe Life shirt, cool. too, because it's not that much more expensive. <laughs> And you get a lot more coverage. I agree with that. Yeah, I totally. think too many people try to be like tactical and look like the movies and mm -hmm. just just have the plate carriers. And they're useful if that's all you got and you can throw it on quick. They can still. I have one. So. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But uh, I think it's useful also to have the whole vest. Yeah, I agree with that. Especially for, sure. for like not when stuff hasn't gone crazy yet, something mm -hmm. you can wear under your clothes. Like mm -hmm. if it's in Venezuela or something right now, you can't run around the plate carrier on. In that situation, it, going to the store. Yeah, I mean, you might get like mugged or something, or the police <laughs> try to give you. They crap. have plate carriers, but they're selling their hair for right. Food yeah, and so doesn't... in a situation in between total breakdown and just like if things are getting a little hairy, mm -hmm. having something you can wear under your clothes. Break the rules. Is there another overhyped? Is there anything? Oh, there's probably that? plenty. Oh, probably. We should do overhyped channels and make enemies. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> My, how's my selfie? Oops, I'm terrible. I, I talked a big game. How do I do this? Oh my goodness, what is happening? <laughs> All right, so thanks for coming and hanging out. Yeah, thank you so much yeah. for, for taking us to this beautiful Red Rock. No sweat. Next time we're going to do the fire challenge in person. In person. Mm -hmm. One-handed still? Oh, So I yeah. can't cheat? Okay. Yeah. We'll tie our hands. All right, sounds good. <laughs> <laughs> thanks for watching, guys. <laughs> thank you all. I'll talk to you tomorrow, but for today. Talk to you all tomorrow. Bye.